This is Stephen Samuel from Design Visionaries, and today I'm going to uh, be delighted to do a little tutorial on the View Break tool in NX8. And so the View Break tool is a tool that allows you to do drawings of things that are very long and to cut out the middle. So for example, I have this tool here, this very long swaging tool. It's about 38 uh, inches from here to there. And if I go ahead and go into the drafting mode, uh, you can see there's a, a view of that on there already. And right here is where you'll find the view break tool. Or you can also say insert view and find it in view break. And when you go into the menu, you'll notice that it's very different than the old menu. And um, as many menus go, you have to make sure that all the red asterisks asterisks turn into green check marks. So the very first thing I want to do is select the view that I'm breaking. There you go. And then I go down to the next red asterisk. And this is the uh, break line one. So you can um, put in a break line one and a break line two. I'm just going to um, say break line one by um, point position or just a position on the screen. But if I want to get fancy, I can make it um, uh, an offset, a uniform offset from some artifact or something like that. And my break line, too, I'm just going to uh, arbitrarily put right there. And as you can see, the two break lines are now drawn. And if I like what I see and I like the way everything's positioned, all I have to do to finish is, is say apply or select apply. There you have it. It's as simple as that. And that's very nice. Now, if I want to get a little bit more fancy, I can edit this. I can just double click on it and I can go to edit. And what I'd like to do is edit the style. So this uh, thing is a solid bar. So I can go down to the uh, solid, solid rod command and click that and it will change the style there. And as you can see now, it's solid rod with the proper cross hatching and everything. And uh, these two things are touching. Maybe I don't want that. So I'm going to adjust the gap. So here's the gap command. And I'm going to make it 0.35, let's say, and apply that. And the gap changes automatically. And everything is great. Uh, now, um, having done the uh, broken view, or the view gap, or, I'm sorry, the view break, I can then go to my dimension tool. And I can dimension the the whole rod or bar. And as you can see, the full 38 is uh, dimensioned. So it's all uh, associative and smart. And if I update the length of that bar or change it, of course, that automatically updates. So that is a wonderful uh, improvement. Uh, should make our drafting, drafting job much easier. And again, this is Steve Samuel from Design Visionaries. And this video will be on nxtutorials.com, along with many other videos about NX8. I hope you enjoy. Thank you very much.